What? Mm. You ready? Good morning, everybody. Morning. Guess where we are? No, we're not in Clackett Lane. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're not. Mm. We're actually in Sutton Scotney Services on the A34 northbound. Which is unusual to see you in the truck, isn't it? Yep. Doing a domestic doing job. Domestic, doing a yeah. UK job. Doing a little local UK job up to Inverness. Um, well, it is local, isn't it? Little three it's day. UK, isn't it? Yeah, little three day trip, just domestic work. Um, um, got to go out to Inverness Airport and drop something off out there. Uh, just over 600 miles, that's all, isn't it? So mm. it's not a lot. But 600 miles back as well. Yeah. Ish. But it's not like going down to southern Spain nah. or Poland or nah. Italy or somewhere. No, nah, this is just local work for us. Um, yeah. So that's it, we've got to go out there. We just fought our way up from Chichester hmm. through the mayhem, which is Monday morning traffic with loads of rain and what have you. Mm, I've got rain and in it, my glasses. Yeah, so um, we've just been in to use the cars and get our coffee from Max and it's full of French people off of a coach. Anybody think we were gone to France? Yeah, I thought all, we, oh, whoa, we're all that <laughs> French noise. They're all standing around in the way, weren't they? All like headless chickens. Well, kids, weren't oh they? yeah. Anyway, I so we had to say bonjour. For bonjour. A <laughs> yeah. No. So right. So that's it. We got a little trip up to Inverness and back. Um, we should, it should take about three days, maybe a little bit, might not. And. Um, We'll see what happens. I haven't been to Scotland. I haven't been to the Highlands for a long, long time. No, nor have I. No. I used to be up there all the time. Yeah, but you've been at it since me. I used to live up there. I, last time I went out, I was in the 80s, I think, when I was on uh. British road surfaces, when I used to be a proper trucker, roping and sheeting and all weathers and all that sort of stuff. It's fun memories, though. It's Sleep. memories. No, I had a problem. No, I yeah, no, I slept across the seat, the seats in my pants. Oh God, not that again! <laughs> oh, God. Anyway, on that bombshell, we got to crack on. <laughs>
Dad on, was it? Look, four hours exactly to Norton Keynes with all that old up this morning and everything. So we didn't do too bad, did we? Come on, Van, get in front so we know what you're doing. Right, about. Right, keep going. And that midget. I'm not being funny or anything, that's called a midget. Yeah, it's not a little bloke driving that car. MG it's it's, it's an MG midget. A lot of people won't even know what an MG midget was all about. It's off of the days when I was a little midget, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> little nipper look. Before I've done all this lot. Right, we'll um, see if we can get over here. I normally park where that Caffrey's is. a little bit less uh, hectic. I think we're going here today. We'll just park out in here. Get amongst all the rabble. Let's see what's what. Oh, it ain't too bad in here, look. Uh, spin around and go up behind. No, I won't go beside this bloke here, look. It's not very big considering it's for both sides, is it? It ain't, is it? No. That I'm very reluctant to park up in this bit at night. The only little parking space now, and I. Yeah. So you can only just do a complete circle with all that room now. Look at this crappy old lock. Mm. Right. There we go. Let's go and do our business. Get coffee. Pinkle. And a, no, I don't want a stinkle. Just a pinkle. No, I was going. I went and a. But it's oh. anyway. Well, that was a bit of experience, wasn't it? <laughs> the place is full of bloody coaches, isn't it? Oh dear, I've never seen um, Clackett Lane, Norton, Norton Cane so bloomin' busy. That's mental, mm -hmm. isn't it? And there's people buying food, obviously at McDonald's and Leon's and all them places, and they can't sit down because there's people bringing bloody packed lunches in and sitting down, and flasks. Actual lunch boxes. Yeah, taking spaces up. I think that's a bit rude, don't you? I do. Oh, Flasks dear. on the table, yeah. blatant. Yeah, blatantly doing it. I don't know. Anyway, um, what? I'm going to see how long we've got now to go up, get up to Inter Interness. That's another place altogether, isn't it? What's this bloke doing backwards and forwards, backwards and forwards? Make your mind up, mate. Um, yeah, so, what's the time now? 1300. So we've got to hit the Hem the Hem Six up up through the roadworks past Manchester. We've got another 440 miles to do on our little local trip. Um, so we'd be up. We've got to deliver tomorrow lunchtime up there. We've got to meet somebody that's getting off of a plane. Um, so we've got a rendezvous about one o'clock, I think. Um, so when we park up tonight, I'll have to work out my hours and. Um, just see what's what. We've got plenty of time, I think. So we, once we get up north of Manchester, it's not too bad, is it? I'm a bit disappointed we haven't seen anyone we know. Yeah, you think coming sort of um, domestic, you'd see a few, wouldn't you? Because obviously abroad, you don't think you're going to see anybody, do you? Unless we're on holiday. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, Lanzarote, that was good. Yeah. So um, yeah, so we ain't seen anybody yet, have we? We've seen one daft Mercedes with no mirrors. Oh, a Shrek. Yeah, a Shrek, with, Shrek. His, with his ears all stuck at the top, look. Um, so, there we go. Right, a bit of crack on. I've had 54 minutes, so I'll just sort myself out. We'll have an hour, and then we'll get on up the road, eh? Get the old... Um, i have to place the toll tag up in the window, because I don't stick them, as you know, because it's not a trophy. It's not to prove that I'll go up the M6 toll. Are you ready, then? I think so. Yeah, let's go. Bit of an experience, wasn't it? It's been busy. Obviously, you can't get dressed in the mornings. Look at the state of it. Look at our clothes is all inside out. Look. Look. It was dark. Look at it. <laughs> dark. <laughs> look, all our pockets are hanging out. No, it's only the t-shirt. <laughs> You've been walking around. Look, look at the state of it. Look. <laughs> I have my jacket. I'm gonna have to check your dress in the morning. Oh, make sure you're dressed appropriately to go out in public. Yes. Right, so we've stuck our tag up. We haven't stuck it up, I've just laid it up on the table so it uh, 
we can get through the barrier at the toll. So I've just looked at my hours and we've done four hours, four hours and one minute driving. So it's a bit of a funny place really, because normally when we're doing European work, I'll do three, three and a half hours, have a full break, do another three, three and a half hours and just run out what, what time we need. But if I do four hours now, obviously that's an eight hour drive. We've only got another hour or two, our nine hour, and then we'd have to go into a ten. But if I stop on eight, it means we've got five hours still up to Inverness. Yeah, so um, we'll get the other side of Manchester, see what the M6 is like up through the roadworks. No, we don't want no incidents. Um, and then we'll work it out. Perhaps I'll do two and a half hours and we'll have another full break. And then we can plan it on from there. The payage. Hi, the payage. Go through the left hand line. It's um, got a tag. It's just propped up. So when you park in Norton Keynes, you get a good deal overnight, you get a free pass. So it is a good deal paying when you pay your full whack in there, isn't it? You get your meal voucher, you get your free toll pass, and your parking. I think the parking works out really cheap. I can't remember exactly what it all is, I don't know. Um, come on, Reed, there we go. So that can now be placed down out of the way. Don't need that until we come back down, do we? Wednesday, stroke Thursday.
going to call it a day at Lockerbie. Lockerbie truck stop. Oh, um, I'm going to go in and fuel up and then find our place for the night. Don't we? Yeah, I've got a bit of sunshine. Yeah, it makes a change, doesn't it? Refrigerator parking. Yes. Changed it a little bit. Um, I think it's been re tarmacked actually. I don't think it was this good the last time I came in. Big go, isn't it? Good place, big parking. The thing is, we've got to try and park on our own. You don't know what's going to be coming up next to you, do you? <laughs> um, anyway, Oop. let's go and get some weasel. Focus. Uh, I don't know. I, I don't know because I've got to go like look like a dinlo with my <laughs> very focals every time I look at the camera. Like if that. I look like like that, I'm just normal. Anyway, normal. That's that, isn't it? We've had a nice evening, right? Oh, that's charged up. Look, that's all. All this. This is all charged, ready for tomorrow for you. Um. So we had a nice little evening in the bar, didn't we? Mm, we haven't been in the truck. No, we've been out of the truck virtually all evening from after we... Yeah. Well, it's 20 past nine now. We had a little bit of a, almost a catastrophe with the fuel, didn't we? <laughs> what a din low. I, I've got my pin number written down in my old diary and we never ever need pin numbers normally in the UK. For that car. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I know we knew, knew pin numbers here because um, we use key fuels in the UK, so that's one pin number, and you use DKV in Europe, and the the mm -hmm. DKV cards with all the trucks are all the same pin number in Europe. Yes. So like I did, know, I'll put that in, which it didn't accept it, did it? Obviously. And then I phoned the boss up, and he gave me pin number for the key fuel, but he didn't know that all the vehicles had their <coughs> their own <coughs> pin numbers. Or their own cards. <coughs> For their own cards on key fuels. So he gave me his key fuel card number, which, which is wrong again. <laughs> so that was two wrong pin numbers. I only had one more go and I was going to be locked out. <laughs> so I phoned uh, one of our other drivers and he said, no, it's a. And, and as soon as he said it, I thought, yeah, I know it's an individual number. <laughs> so anyway, we got over that, got that sorted. And we went in and paid our money and um, got sorted out and yeah. had our pink or no, a sprinkle powder? Yeah. A nice sprinkle nice powder? Shower. Yeah. Well, mine was all right, except for one thing. <laughs> Oof. I know I've brought this up before. Why do blokes think it's right to bring up all the phlegm from their throats and their noses? I've, well, I don't get phlegm and throat in my nose. You don't smoke. And, oh, is that what it is? Possibly. There's all the gobbing up and the snotting up. And that went on. He was in the shower when I went in, not in my shower, but sort of, one down the way, yeah. and I got sorted out, and all the time he was still in that shower, which was about five minutes into my shower, he was snotting up and gobbing out. These blokes are disgusting, aren't they? Mm. I would never do that. Well, there's nobody else in my shower except me. Well, there's only one shower in the ladies, oh. isn't it? It was lovely. Yeah, it's good for her. So, um, yeah, and then we had... Um, Chips and curry sauce. Oh, a couple of pints of beer, haven't we? Well, you have. Well, yeah, I have. Yeah. We haven't done that for a long time, have we? Have, have sit in a bar and have a beer. Yeah, it was holiday, I think, the last time. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, yeah, not a bad we evening. Don't really do that, do we? We don't go out to bars, do we? No. But we just sat and chatted, watched a bit of telly, looked at our phones. Caught up on all the messages on the channel to everybody's been either liked, loved, or commented to. Till the next time. Till the next time. So I can't be accused of not liking or loving or commenting. 
Um, and you won't get a lot of YouTubers doing that. They normally don't comment at all. I've done a few as well. Yeah, yeah. So, um, should we do a couple of shout outs while we're here? Yeah, so. Right, let's have a look, see what we got. Scotty Marshall. He f flashed me on the A34 early September. <laughs> mm, sorry I missed you, but I might have seen you actually. I'm, I'm, I do see odd flashy, but you know, don't know whether people are flashing people in, which is a very, very rare thing <laughs> these days, or acknowledging. Uh, sorry, I'm going off subject. Anyway, Scotty. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. That's your shout out, buddy. There you go. Hope you're happy with that. And um, we've got Colin and Rachel. NB Corky. What's the NB Corky? I can't remember what it is. Anyway, you know, you'll know exactly what that is. We've got Colin and Rachel, in brackets, MB Corky, ex-trucker, 80s, 90s and noughties. Long uh, time. Long time. So, thanks um, for watching. Thanks for watching, mate. And, um, yeah, cool. I don't know if you're retired yet. Possibly. If you are, I hope you're in retirement, re enjoying retirement, or whatever you're doing. Mm -hmm. And, um, do you want to do one? No, you do. All right, then. we got Mr. Mark Smith from Nottingham. 35 UK euro, what's that? I don't know. See, these have been written down so long ago from messages, but you'll know, you'll know what that means. So, Mr. Mark in bracket Smith from Nottingham. That's your shout out, buddy. Yeah, thanks uh, for your support. That's it, it's great, yeah. And um, we got James Williamson comments on YouTube it's from his comments isn't yeah. it so that's what yeah from the, comments. from the comments that's in the cans vlog I take it yes these yes. are all the, the new series yes well the series that is on now at the moment be not at the moment no 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 not at the moment that's about two months ago <laughs> <laughs> yeah but <laughs> Yeah, the way well, the, just gone on, the way I'm going on, you know. But, um, I've got two more to edit in this series you're watching at the moment, and I'm finding it the difficult. Cans the cans and that cologne series, and I'm finding it a bit difficult enough with, you know, mm -hmm. one thing and another. So um, yeah, we will get there. It's a little bit slow, but it's getting there. Isn't it? Yeah. So um, there we go. Oh, so we've had a good run up today, haven't we? We've done mm. eight hours driving. We've stopped in a really nice truck stop, Lockerbie Trucks. Stop, yes. Lockerbie. Yeah, I knew you got it wrong there. Lockerbie truck, Lockerbie truck Stop is a really nice sort of truck stop. I think it might be family run. And they're really yeah. friendly people. Nice, pleasant little bar, restaurant. Yeah, it's a sort of like a friendly. function room, isn't it? Yeah. Restaurant's that, nice. I think I've only good. yeah, I think I've only stopped here overnight a bit two or three times but I've been here a few times on breaks and come in for diesel and that and remember my pin number that time I suppose but Angie's written it down in my diary now but so that that pin number was in my diary but it's in one of my old diaries last year's diary yeah. probably it's at home yeah because whenever we fill up in petrol stations we, all we got to do is sign the the receipt we don't have to put a pin mm. number in so yeah. anyway it's just an overlook on my side so um We've got tomorrow just over five hours from here up to Inverness. So I think we might be kicking off about um, six o'clock because we'll have to have a break on route and that'll get us up there about 12. And our contacts landing just after 12 o'clock, so it should work about right, shouldn't it? Yeah. So, um, yeah, so we're gonna. Mm, got a nosy neighbour though. Oh, yeah, he's got a bloke in a scanner sitting here, he reversed in. Got out, walked around his truck, looked at the registration, then looked in. Oh, it's an English truck with a steering wheel on the wrong side. And then he <laughs> he's sitting in his truck just looking in all the time. Yeah, but I did say, you know, watch out because he might be, he might be watching the vlogs. Yeah, but don't <laughs> just come and say hello. Yeah. I don't think he is. I think he was just rude. <laughs> if you see us, <laughs> just if you see us, just come just up and say hello. hello. Don't just gawp. We're not that famous. We're not like some of these people. We're not famous. We're not. Well, some people think they're it's famous. People. Some truck drivers that are on YouTube think they're famous, and they're not. Oh wow. <laughs> anyway, on that bombshell, we're going to go. We're going to have a few minutes before we go to bed, and then we're going to get clean our teeth, 
and do whatever. Yeah. And um, that's it. So we'll see you tomorrow, guys. Thanks for travelling with us up to on a, Lockerbie. On a little local job. On a little local job. UK job. UK stroke domestic local job, which it is a local job. Uh, in the well, widest. We haven't had to speak another language, really, no. have we? Well, it's a di slightly different noise tomorrow, but I'm sure we get over that. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, so in the in the it's widest all English, it's just with a different accent. Yeah. That's all. <laughs> in the wider scheme of things, this is a a, a little local job for us, isn't it? Mm. Because you don't yeah, often come out on local jobs, do you? No, but it's nice to do a vlog of the a UK. UK job. Yeah. That's a bit longer than. Mm. But the only thing is, there's too much road footage, and then you don't know which to put in, and you, it's not like foreign runs, you know, and you get a lot of other stuff going on, and mm. it's only our breaks and a bit of road footage. But yeah, you, know, you guys like there's that, I think. Some nice scenery though. Up yeah. The Lake District. Yeah, there's that little bit there, and so um, right. Anyway, we're waffling now. Um, Usual. Yeah, nine minutes. Nearly 10. We'll see you tomorrow, guys. No there, Thumbs up, subscribe, and all that old malarkey. And we'll see you tomorrow. Good night. Night. See ya. Bye.